Hey everyone, welcome back to Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. Um, in the last video, we learned the ability to brand enemies, making them an ally to us, possessing them. And that earned us the ability to have our branded, branded orcs go up the ranks in the Nemesis system and become war chiefs. And that's our main objective right now to get all the war chiefs at the top of the rankings to um, be branded by us. But we're going to take a little break from that because I want there's uh, multiple quest chains. As you can see right here, right, you've got um, these are slave missions right here. Then you've got the um, the main story missions, normally indicated by a skull. And then you've got this mission here, which is the dwarf that we met in the video before last. And um, I'm going to catch up with this dwarf, see what he knows, because he said to us that he knows more about the treasures that we're searching for. So we're going to pay a little um, drop into this guy and see what um, he has to give us. So big game. This dwarf claims to know the location of more artifacts. From Celebrimbor's past. So let's jump into this. See what he's up to. Because I want to keep up to date with each character, each quest chain. I alternate each video. You shouldn't hear me. It's a clean kill. And none of it is going to go to waste. What's your name, Ranger? Italian. What were you? A lieutenant? No, actually, I, I was a captain. Oh, my mistake! We have a captain in our midst! Well, better look sharp, eh? Captain's coming. Better sharpen the swords, eh? And make sure our boots are nice and shiny. <laughs> oh, so tell me, Captain. Have you ever hunted a Graug? That's a the big guy, isn't it? You promise me. Aye. Not just any Graug. The largest one I ever came across. <laughs> we must prepare. And I should do just fine. I've been trained very well. My dog, Silver, was trained very well. That was before she got eaten by a warg. Hunt! It's not about rules, my captain. We're not going to line up and have someone play with our lives. It's about instinct, and it's about guts. Which, as you can see, I know a thing or two about. <laughs> You want basics on the hunt. Follow me. So this guy's gonna teach us how to hunt down the, the big hunt is giants. its own beast. One you must learn to tame. First lesson of Karagor hunting. Do not die. What do we need them for? We ride them. A worthy mount for a dangerous hunt. Now these beasts will not be impressed by your rank. All flesh tastes the same to them. Once you go on the hunt, Captain, you'll come out a changed man. Hopefully for the better, but you never know. When I was hunting wargs, I picked up their ways quickly. But Cargors, well, those bastards are a tougher breed. It took me nearly a year to figure them out. Cargors. Buggers hate water. I once tried to ride one through a river, and she hightailed it up a cliffside with me on its back. Amazing what they'll do to avoid a good cleaning, eh? And the hunt is my mistress. Beautiful, thrilling, infectious. And she doesn't nag like my wife. So do we. Oh, you haven't lived until you've been on the hunt, Captain. The very air smells different. Like triumph. Ranger, over here! So I'm guessing Karagors are required to tame the um, Grogs. That one over there looks quite aggressive. Don't even try creeping up on a Karagor. It'll catch your scent a mile away. What do you propose then? Why don't you hop in and introduce yourself? Ask it for a ride. So we got an ability Karagor Hunter. You gain the ability to counter a Karagor's leap attack, which will also stun the beast. Then press R1 to mount him. 
Okay, so we can already mount Karagors by jumping on them from above. But this gives, gives us another option to mount from the ground. So let's jump down there. When a Karagor charges, you have two options. Knock the bastard down. So we can't avoid that. It can't cancel that. It's only when this does the leap attack. His bite normal. His normal bite, we can't. There we go. Do that one. And we can run over to it. Mount it. Now we got to dominate it. So it's a pretty good way to get a Karagor mounted um, when in combat. So is he going to do one? He made it look easy. He just jumped on his. I guess... Um, Dwarves are stealthier than me. That's about the same time it took me to take one. You might be a natural, Captain. You didn't fare too bad back there. Where'd you get your training, Captain? I hail from the Black Gate. The Black Gate. Nice place. Sounds depressing. <laughs> Let's find some Uruks. Now that you tame the beast, let's see if it will fight for you. Doing a lot of stuff I already know how to do. Kill more Uruks than Torvins. A little competition. <laughs> do I have to kill them with my sword? I guess that's how you do it, isn't it? Then you finish them off with the um, Karago. How much time have we got? Then I kill the one from behind. Oh mate, I'm winning this. Don't you worry. Oh, it doesn't, it doesn't always kill them that fight. I think you can get interrupted from it. That's the problem. The best way to do it, I think, is um, knock them down like that, and then... Oh, we're done. Even the fiercest beast can be used for good. You've been hunting and learning for long, Dwarf. For years and years. Land used to be more lush. Now a doom slowly sweeps over it. Like much of Mordor. Yes. Though the doom does add a spice to the hunt. Sure, you can ride a car, but can you shoot from one? You take him up high! Leave the ground dogs to me! So kill more Oryx than Torvin again. So we'll kill on the archers, should be fairly easy. Just headshot them. There's one more up there. Knock off that dwarf! He'll have far up name the nameless hills and dells. He drank from yet untasted wells. Is there still more? Let's kill this guy. So we're killing the Oryx in the camp now. Let's shoot the fire. Running short on lessons? Running long on lip? You'll need to think on your feet. When we face the Grog, can't always look to me for help. The hunt is about discipline. Training yourself to see the perfect moment, rather than being told it. I once tracked a grey eagle back to her nest. I decided to let them be. Even before they toss me to the rocks below. Yeah, this mission is kind of meant to be like a tutorial on how to use this, but it's a bit late in the game. We already know how to do all this. I'm going to um, step back and um, use the bow and arrow just to pick all the heads off, because it, it's hard to kill a lot of them, a big army of them, when... Um, Actually riding it. I don't really know the key way to do that. Maybe you can do this and eat them. But it's only when they're knocked down. 
guess you just spam triangle, can't you? To um, hit them to knock them down. My character was almost dead. Oh shit, it died. Alright, back on this one again. This time we're going to take note of our health. And obviously not rush in too much. We've had, because of the checkpoints, we've got full health as well. So it um, should be easier to not die. Should be. It's better using the bone arrow, I think, on um, these guys. The aim um, shield guys, because they're hard to knock down. I mean, that's meant to heal them as well when you finish them with the Karagura. He's got loads on him over there. <laughs> what is it with dwarves and wanting to compete for kills? It's the same as Gimli in the films. Twenty-six, eleven. We should get the bonus complete here. <laughs> Stop the runner. Kill more orcs. Yeah, we need to do. So this is one more guy we need to kill. That's it. I'm gonna eat him. Torben is too quiet. Something must be wrong. Go to him, Talion. He's fell behind. Perhaps we should track the hunter. So we activate this and we can see his tracks. There's tracks everywhere. Which way does he go? This way. Is he down? Is that him over there? Torven needs help. Do a leaping takedown. Yeah, that's Torben on the ground. You want your back, mate. You didn't have him. What does riding Karagors have to do with killing Grogs? All these questions, Captain. Well, you were supposed to follow orders. You are testing my patience, Torven. Pay attention. Learn to respect the beast. You're going to need size and strength to fight the mighty Grog. Remember, on the hunt, respect is earned. Who knows? He will even call you sir, eh? <laughs> so a mission all about hunting grogs ended up not having nothing to do with grogs, really. This dwarf is far from home. Not all those who wander are lost. Alright guys, we're going to um, end this video here. Because if we start a new mission now, I feel like the video is going to go on too long. Because the missions are getting longer now as we get deeper into the game. So um, thanks for watching guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. We'll probably do the War Chiefs. So thanks for watching, see you next time. Bye.